Yo, what is up guys and welcome in another Truck Day R video. Sorry for not posting every week boys, but I have been super busy with my projects for this game and I will show you guys my latest project shortly. But before that, I want to cover some of the big updates that have made it into the game right now. One of those is the possibility to put your name and number on the gear set without having to go you know the photoshop route the gimp route and personalizing it like that and then importing it into the game so we're just gonna you know type my name right now and just like that as you can see we do have the name and number on the gear set so we're going to put the number as well but as you can see boys we do have this possibility so on all gear sets you're gonna be able to put your name and number on them and also one other thing that i have been super hard at work on as you can see is the speedway bike i am gonna show you guys this bike is pretty much ready for release i just have to do a couple of uh quick uh, tuning and stuff like that and also you know i made the speedway bike why not go ahead and make a speedway track and there we go this is the work cloud i hope i pronounced it right grand prix this is a real life stadium and a real life track switching to the inside putting pressure on it's past him past him smashing on the inside tight into the last lap what a final oh. the fim speedway gp usually comes to this place i think once or twice a year correct me if i'm wrong i haven't been super close to speedway in the last couple of years i used to follow it quite quite a lot before but i kind of lost track of all the uh, the races and stuff and we're gonna go into the track i'm going to show you guys at first uh no wait let's actually do uh like this 500 times so we're gonna go through all the times of the day because i do have something special which regards to the track and the track modding you might probably have seen it in the previous edits but right now we do have the time of day and we have the possibility to put objects and lights that activate during certain time of day so we're just gonna go ahead and spin some laps while we wait for the time of day to change and as you can see boys this is the workload stadium workload olympic stadium sorry the track is ready almost i do have to finish some of the uh the objects and stuff like that and i am quite rusty so i need to warm up a little bit but yeah, let me know what you think about this down below. There's also been a lot of work done in the steering of the bikes and stuff like that. On the engine. And yeah, as you can see, we got the lights turned on. Which is nice. And there should be the uh, night time shortly. Okay, this is the evening. And I was testing out stuff, you know, so I didn't put lights in the evening. But... It's going to come nighttime shortly and we are going to have lights. There you go, boys. That's the new uh, newest addition to the track making so you can really go crazy with your tracks. You can have multiple, you know, um, multiple ways of having the track. You could probably have in the morning where there's no people in the standings. And then you put all the people at night and the stadium fills up at night or you know the lights and stuff like that you can put uh pretty much whatever you want into these uh sections as as long as you name them correctly they're gonna work straight out in the game as you can see and the physics so far of the bike are working quite nice it's very easy to understand how the bike works and the engine tuning and the transmission tuning is going pretty well i am liking the uh, oh, oops i am liking the way that the bike is handling so far and i'm really enjoying like the uh the dimensions of the track because you just you, ju you don't just go balls out you know full throttle everywhere and actually takes a little bit of patience and you know skill to uh to go fast and i think in multiplayer this could be a very good addition because yeah there will be the skill gap there will be the difficulty to go fast but it's not like supercross or motocross where you know 
making mistakes could cost you the race like making mistakes here it's quite a bit difficult so it can make the racing a lot a lot closer and a lot more fun i think and i am developing now the starting gate for uh for this type of racing you know they they do not start with the uh the usual uh starting gate like the door bikes they do have for the people that don't know they have a rope that you know you four people on the same line get close to this rope and then when the gate drop let's say this rope comes up super quick and then you are good to go so i am trying to do something like that for uh, for this track as well so yeah boys let me know in the comments what you think about my latest work my latest updates and also the big man latest updates and also boys you know i couldn't just do a video about the speedway you know i had to show you guys the latest work made by gianluca we do have as you can see here it might this might look familiar to you except there is something missing and it's been replaced with something else let's see in the comments down below if you can find out what's the difference between this bike and a normal bike and i am going to spin a couple of laps around my compound right here this compound is released and available for download so let me know down in the comments below if you had the chance to try this track or not if you haven't had the chance to try this track i highly recommend you do because i feel like this layout it's super super fun to you know just hop on the game you know after work and spin a couple of laps and kind of do some flowing motos and stuff like that throw some big whips oh not not this big maybe <laughs> a little bit smaller could be good as well but yeah boys if you haven't downloaded this track i will put the link down in the description below so you can go ahead and test it out and i'm just gonna you know keep spinning some laps here and show you guys around but yeah so the big man has been super hard at work lately there's been like daily builds you know daily updates i haven't been able to you know keep up to date on you guys with the videos and stuff like that because i've been super busy learning uh, 3d modeling and stuff like that because i do really want to uh, pursue a career in uh, in this kind of stuff so i haven't been able to post super consistently on the youtubes but i hope that this video you know i hope that you will enjoy this video so i'm sorry about that boys i will try to be a lot more consistent i would love to you know organize one day of the week to you know maybe do a streaming and host races and stuff like that because i would really love to play my tracks with you boys and you know shred some races and uh banging bars and stuff like that so if you are if you do have track day and you do want to race let me know down in the comments below what would be your day to race you know what would be the preferable day during the week during the weekends because i do live in italy so you know the time zone would be kind of an issue i think but if we can organize let me know down in the comments below i would be more than happy to host lobbies at night and play with you boys and i think this is going to be all for today I hope you guys have enjoyed the video and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.